It's the misanthropic one, aka Face the Music. Back up in this bitch for another rant. American Idol is rumored to be looking to hire someone else to replace Simon Cowell because Simon is going off doing his own show, The X Factor. I'm not too. Uh, sure what the X Factor is. I didn't do too much research on that, you know. But I love Simon. He's a fucking brutally honest motherfucker, and I respect that. You know, like, people that come up there and, you know, thinking they, they could just be the next big thing, he'll shut them right down. He'll, he'll, he'll smash them, be like, nah, you don't have it. Nope. You suck, you know what I mean? And I love that about Simon. But he's leaving... And they want someone to replace him. And there's a rumor that, you know, Howard Stern is one of the people that Fox wants, you know, to come in and fill his shoes. And it's just a rumor, mind you. And there's just motherfuckers going crazy already. Oh, no, 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 no. Howard can't be on there. You know, um, I'll stop watching if he's on there, blah, 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 you know. And number one, motherfuckers are going crazy over a rumor. That's just a rumor. Number two, if he was on there, the show would be, you know, just as good as when Simon was there. Because let's just face it, motherfuckers, Simon was that show. Simon was the show because, you know, you got Paula and Paula Abdul and Randy Jackson, you know, they're both in the music industry or were in the music industry. They know music, but they're not brutally honest with these people. Simon will tell you straight up, no, you suck, you know, no, can't do it. Like Paula and Randy want to be fucking nice about, same thing with Ellen, Ellen DeGeneres. Now she's coming on the show, she's she's nice, she has a nice image, she's not going to put these people in their place, you know what I mean, and I'm not saying, you know, oh yeah, it's just cool to be, uh, you know, quote unquote, evil, I guess, or whatever, however you positive motherfuckers want to perceive it, but, you know, you need someone on there that's going to be brutally honest with people. People need to know. No, you can't sing. No, you're not what the mainstream or the masses are looking for, you know? And I don't even know why I'm backing this shit up, you know? Because to be honest, I, I watch American Idol only for the beginning stages, the tryouts, because I love seeing these stupid-ass motherfuckers get up there and make fools of themselves. Honestly, that's why I watch it. But I do understand the mechanics behind the show, you know, so for all these stupid idiots going crazy saying, oh, Howard Stern, you know, it, uh, he has no musical credentials and this and that, the, the motherfucker has been, was a music DJ before he was a shock jock or whatever, a radio, uh, talk show radio host, excuse me, radio talk host, radio talk show host, yeah, and, you know, the dude, the dude's been, you know, bigging up bands from, from day one, you know, Sugar Ray, before they got signed, before they were, uh, anybody, they went on his show, they, uh, they got on there, they blew up, he, um, talked about Skunk Anansi, a, a, a band from, from England, he, when they were, uh, I don't want to say nobodies, but when they were coming up, they went multi-platinum after he said, oh, these guys are going to be big, you know, so Howard knows his shit, you know, he's, he's done it for multiple artists, and 
it's just it's just ridiculous how motherfuckers are saying that you know they're they're flipping out Ellen saying oh yeah well I don't want him on here I'll leave blah 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 <sighs> fucking people need to grow up you know people just want th this is exactly and I've said it before in my other rants this is exactly what I'm talking about these motherfuckers these people just want this fake ass optimism this fake ass positivity no that's not that's not how life is if someone's singing and their voice is cracking don't give them don't don't butter them up and say ah oh, you know you you're good but you know uh but you know you need to work on your top no no nigga you suck you suck go uh, you need to cut this shit out Find another profession, get fucking lessons, because you suck. You know, you need to give someone a harsh lessons in reality. That's it. That's all it is. I don't know why why people are making a big deal, because someone as honest, that's what we watch Simon for, someone as honest as Howard Stern going to be on the show, that would be, that would make the show even better than what it was. I mean, I love Simon, but, you know, let's keep it real. All you motherfuckers are saying you wouldn't watch the show would really watch it just to see what Stern would say. And another thing I heard was, oh, he's he's going to be dropping F-bombs and this and this. You know, he's going to be cursing and, and saying fuck on TV and shit. The motherfucker was, Stern was on terrestrial radio for most of his career so he censored himself I'm pretty sure he knows how to censor himself for fucking for fucking one bullshit hour on television meanwhile the guy was on terrestrial radio for four to five hours in the morning censoring himself or having the corny ass FCC up his ass so I'm pretty sure he knows the rules by now so all you motherfuckers need to stop hating and just envision reality for once. Stop trying to live in this candy-coated, fucking Ellen DeGeneres uh, fantasy. I can't take it anymore, all right? So, I want to hear your comments. Leave your love, leave your hate. Most of all, subscribe. Peace, bitches.